Wow, what an amazing day it is today. Even the blackbird thinks so. We've had so much rain recently, so it's so nice to see the sun today. I wanted to show you today this area of my garden. This is normally the one area that I really love to come into, but having just come into it now, it needs some work. As a um, dealer in vintage and antique garden wear, this is where I keep all my stock and this is where customers would come to. Um, I don't know what's happened to it over the winter. <laughs> it looks an absolute state. I think we've taken some bits of furniture out, we've sold bits and I've added some stock and obviously just thrown it into this area and it looks dreadful. But that is all going to change. So to explain about the rest of the plot, the house, um, Star Corner, sits in about a quarter of an acre plot and um, it's it's the one frustrating area that I really find so frustrating that it's it's just a mess and I really do love my garden. At the front of the property there are tons and tons of um, rubble that needs taking away. Lorry and lorry loads and that's going to cost a lot of money and there's always something else that I want to spend my money on but I do think that that has to go this year. It's really stopping me getting on from doing other bits. In other places of the garden we've got um, materials, reclamation materials piling up and when we see things as well also for the house we do buy them and they have to be stored somewhere and it just seems as though it's all over the garden. I'm completely embarrassed about the rest of the garden but normally this is the area that I do love. I was just going to come out today just to show you it and then I was going to go back inside but it's such a nice day I'm going to get on my garden express and come up, come out and give it a really 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 good sort out. But first let me show you. This really didn't take me as long as I thought it was going to do. I was dreading it, but the membrane has really helped making it a lot easier to dig up the, the weeds. They're just coming up really easily and I haven't trimmed too much off, off the holly, but it does look better. And it's been so nice because I'm just enjoying the sound of birdsong and just the odd car going by, but it's been such a lovely, lovely afternoon. It's Good Friday, which means it's a bank holiday and today it's quite sunny, the sun's come out and it's the nicest day I think of the whole bank holiday weekend. So I've come back into my garden to carry on. First job I think is to tackle my um, disarray of plant pots. Whilst I'm clearing the plant pots, I think I also need to give the holly tree a bit of a, a cut back. It's getting rather large. So the apple tree, the holly tree and some of the other plantings around the edge of the garden were already there. And then internally, everything is stock for my vintage business and they're all planted in containers. So this is a completely a container garden apart from the external shrubbery. I'm not 100% finished but after two days I'm really happy with the end results and it's looking more like the garden that I love. So I believe my youngest has been busy making cheesecake. Let me go and find her. That will be the perfect end to a very productive couple of days.